Hello and welcome to another Elliot and Matt Show Home Tour. Today we are at the back here in Lightmore Village in Telford and we are filming for Barrett Homes and we are in an Alderney Ooh. house type. Wow, just take a look around. If you turn around and spin, you can see that there are many doors that we many will be doors. going and exploring in, which is going to be very nice. You already feel very at home here in yes. the hallway. It's quite a big, large, spacious hallway. It is, but also it's quite cosy. It is quite cosy. I like the way they've done the, um, you'll see in a minute when we go up the stairs, you've got the kind of sage green yeah. on the wall. Um, this house is full of upgrades. Um, so if we have a look inside, Ooh, you can like see a there is a cupboard. Coach cupboard. Yeah, you've got your, um, I suppose, fuse box. Fuse you've box. got the internet. Yeah, internet points. You could like put a security shoes. system. You could put coats. Uh, again, pretty standard kind of security door with the latches. Um, and a nice kind of panel that lets some yeah, light in. That you can just about see with the sun glaring on it. But yeah, there we go. but that is nice. Also, I think the um, the sockets have been upgraded oh, as yes, well. Oh, yes, the chrome with like the white in there. Yeah, so they're very, very nice. Okay, so we have a hard floor and we have a cupboard under the stairs. Ooh. Which is very handy, actually. Yes, that's that'd be great as like a little shoe cupboard. Yeah, and the cupboard. flooring goes all the way goes all the way in as well. as well, which I think is quite nice. Perfect. Okay. Oh, we've got a dining room. Oh, oh wow. Ta-da. Ta -da. So this is like a double uh, fronted, well, not double fronted, what's it called? A double aspect. Double aspect. Double aspect dining room. It feels very sumptuous. You've got this kind of silvery curtains uh, that are hung from the ceiling. You've got a really funky light. Oh yeah, look at that. Which I'm really liking. Um, the dining table as well. Now you can get, there's, this is quite a large table. It is, it can fit eight people eight in here. Eight seats. Um, and of course, if you didn't want this as a dining room, it could be a playroom, it could be an office, hobby room, yeah. craft room, whatever you wanted. Second second living room. Yeah. Whatever you want. I'd have this as a second living room, yeah. I think. Was it as Kirsty also said, dining rooms are only used at Easter and Christmas. Yeah. Uh, but this is not, I like the way they've put the mirror as well. Yeah. Over there, which kind of gives it um, a bit more dimension, a bit more di dimension to it. I also like the windows. It looks like they push open from half height. Which is good. Actually, it's not half height, it's almost three quarters. Yeah, it's like two thirds. Yeah. Again, there's plenty of plugs. There's plug sockets under there. There's plug socket over here. Um, so plenty of plug sockets. Yeah. I like the curtains that go along the entire wall. Yeah. They're funky. Yeah, they're They'll, very, very nice. If you were to close them at night and you're having a dinner party, it would feel really cosy in here. Yeah. And you could also, if you wanted to, perhaps have a TV yeah. put on the wall here. I like the colour. Yeah, it's lovely. Oh, you blend in. I do. <laughs> right. Um, so coming through, we have... Ta-da! Oh, the kitchen. We have the kitchen. Oh, wow. This is lovely. Yeah. Now, this kitchen, I do believe, is an upgraded kitchen. I think it's the £3,700 package. The appliances have been upgraded. Uh, you don't get these as standard, but it just shows what you could do. Also, uh, the island, what um, what top is this? It is a... This is a quartz top. Quartz, it is, isn't it? Um, and it does feel very, very solid. So if you do go for the extras package um, and you have the quartz, I think it does look like very, very good quality quartz. Okay, should we start a tour of Ooh, the actual... Let's go for a rummage, minutes. come on. Okay, so we have a AEG Eighth. fridge. Perfect. And I do believe this will probably be... The freezer, yeah. Yeah, I quite like the cupboards. They've got like this kind of gold. It's very on trend at the moment. Yeah, with the navy gold with gold. And the navy. You've got plugs behind here. Now these, oh, they open up like this. Ooh. Look. Oh, wow. They're quite funky. I'm liking those. So I think they all do it. So you've got to get the knack. But oh, they're, yeah. quite, they're quite deep. If you look up, you remember. Yeah. They oh, wow, are, they are quite deep. They are quite deep. Um, so there we go. Now I imagine that there are there are different units available. So you don't have to have, I think, the up and over. No, you I imagine could, you can have the standard. No, you could have doors. the regular cupboards if that's something that you're interested in. Plenty of light in this kitchen as well. Yeah. What's under here? We've got oh dishwasher. Ooh, dishwasher. That's who's that? AEG. We've got under sink. Perfect. We have more unders. More unders. Oh, we've got a washer dryer, washer that's dryer. AEG, and of course that's not standard, that will be an upgrade. Uh, AEG hob um, with Ooh. a uh, cooker hood above. Again, all extras. Pan drawers, now I do really like these. Oh, the inlaid cutlery drawers. Yeah, oh, and it's got the glass as well inside. 
Lovely. So that just shows the quality of the upgrade. And we've got another one there, which is very nice. Plenty of worktop space. Oh, yeah. There's yeah. loads of cupboard space as now, well. Now, a wine cooler, that's an extra. That is an extra, but it's the most important extra. Yeah. Got AEG ovens. Microwave and oven. I'm yeah, guessing. that's a grill as well. So oh, we've got it? a, a fan-assisted oven and then a, a, grill. a grill and a microwave, I think. Cupboard. Yeah. And then this must be like a big... Oh, it's the boiler. It's a logic boiler and... And then a, an under larger cupboard. cupboard. Yeah. yeah. Now, of course, the island, if you didn't have the island, which also has cupboards... Oh, wow. Quite a lot of cupboards. Quite you, a few cupboards. You'd be able to put a table here. Yeah. And a dining table. With the island, you don't need a table. You can put some sort of seating down here. There is also, if you come the other side, some bar stools. Oh, is that? Yeah, so you can sit... And enjoy breakfast ah. looking out of your French doors into your garden. Yeah. So it's not just a garden there, there's a garden around the no. back as well. You can just about see there's like a Yeah, and there will be a, a garage as well. I can yeah. see the back of it, the back of it's, um, no, the back of it, it's, it's the sales centre. <laughs> yeah, the back of it is the sales centre. There. there you go. So plugs and sockets as well. What's in here? Oh, I don't know. Oh. Oh. It is a oh, downstairs, a downstairs water closet. Blue. Okay. So, the tiling. So, the tiling, in here it's half height, but that's an extra. Yeah, you, you would get a backsplash tiling behind the sink. Behind the little corner sink. And oh. it would be a standard radiator. The, um, the heated towel rail is an upgrade. I like the wallpaper. Yeah, the wallpaper's fancy. Yeah, what... Um, this mosaic thing. It's Twyford sanitary wear. Twyford sanitary wear, there's your loo. Shall we go and see the living room? Yes. Maureen uses sustainable toilet paper and washes it like nappies. <laughs> oh dear. Right, let's go through into the living room. Ta-da! Wow. Wow, I wasn't expecting this. No, this is really big actually. Yes, it's a very large, spacious living room. You've got two lights, you've got space for your TV, there's space for, I would say, a two or a three-seater sofa. In the corner. Space over here for a two or three-seater sofa. And you could even have an extra wing chair or something over here. You've got the patio doors, which are yeah. very, very nice. And once again, the full height curtains as well. Yes. Across the whole wall. Which, which is a feel really, really nice cozy. feature to have. Plenty of sockets and plugs. I think all the media, the media points are right behind the TV. What do you think of the decor? I like it. it it's neutral, but then you've got the the hit, the, the, the burst of colour, like the cushions, the yeah. chair that you sat on, which is a lovely green. Yeah, nice kind of velour. Yeah, fabric. it's gorgeous. They are lovely. Right. Um, yeah, I'm just admiring the room. It's a very nice, it's just very relaxed, it's very peaceful. Yeah. I felt I feel like I could just sit down and rest. <laughs> I can see the cats running through. <laughs> yeah, shall we go? Oh, there's a thermostat here. Okay, let's go upstairs. Okay, shall we go? Let's go in here first. Okay, so we have. By the way, this is a four-bedroom house. Yes. Um, I'm so guessing this is bedroom number two. We don't know, but it is a bedroom that can definitely fit a double bed in. This is a full-size double bed. And the wardrobes are actually extras. They so, are. But you can see... They are. Yes, they are quite spacious. So if you did have them, there will be a choice of different cupboard doors as well. So they are yeah. nice. I'm not quite sure who, who they're by. It could just be by Barrett Homes. Um, but yeah, it just goes to show that this is a very nice kind of, I suppose, guest room where you live. Yeah. There we go. And then if we move here, the next door is, I'm guessing this is bedroom number four. Yes. Now, we've seen this before. It's like an office bedroom setup. So if you did have someone staying over, this could be a bed. It is a bed, but it's also a sofa. So if you're yeah. doing... I know, gaming, or just want to sit while someone's working. Or have a hobby room. Yeah, it is it is a really nice kind of office space. Could also be a wardrobe room. Yeah, I like the jewel tones on the wall, actually. Yeah, and of course you've got the... Yeah, it's, it's nice. We've seen lots of funky paint effects. Yes. Haven't we? There's a large window as well, and a that massive a clock. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's a huge clock. I massive quite like clock. the, the um, kind of square shape of the windows as well. Yeah, we all like a big clock. Yeah. That's very, very nice. Okay. okay. We'll have a look down the stairs as well, just so you can get a, a look at the the stairs. There we go. That's my coat on the on the banisters. Main will, I think this will be the main bedroom. Oh, wow. 
Wow, look at this. So done out in this kind of navy blue. Again, navy blue, very on trend. You've got the curtains hung all the way across. So it I gives, really like that. Gives that really nice luxury effect. Mm. Um, you could have a wider bed. Oh, you could this. easily have a bigger bed. But there is, uh, again, double aspect windows. You've got space for a TV here if you were the sort of person that wanted a TV. Um, you've got, in this uh, option, sliding wardrobes. Again, these are not as standard. No. But there's plenty of space in them. And they do sort of double the, the size of the room visually because it's, it's mirrored. Yes. Um, so they are very, very nice. I just noticed something in that first one. What have you noticed? There's a door stopper. Oh, because because before they fitted the wardrobe, they would have been the door. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> also, there's a thermostat up here as well, so I think you can control and zone the house. Which is good. Really, really well, which again is really good. You've got radiators, plenty of plug sockets, and you've got the ensuite bathroom. Ooh, wow. Again, um, a standard would just be tiles in the shower. Yeah, but you just feel the three walls of the shower yeah. and then a little bit behind the splashback on yeah. the sink. So you've got different sanitary wear in here. You've got Geberit. Geberit. I haven't seen those before. No. And you've got the towel rail as well, which I imagine would be an upgrade. Yeah. Ooh, and a shaver plug. Ooh, that's nice. For all your shaving needs. Yeah. Why do shavers have different plugs? I never understood that. <laughs> it's the wattage, I think. Safety for the bathrooms. Okay, we have the bathroom. Oh, the main bathroom. Here we are. Yeah. So, same sanitary wear throughout, and I think it's the same situation again. The full height tiles are an upgrade, um, but you just get it at half height around the bath yeah. and shower. Okay, the shower screen so does actually feel quite, um, quite sturdy, so that's good. It feels like it's got a good seal at the yeah. bottom. You've got a bath that's big enough, uh, standard size bath. Um, You've got the ventilation above, you've got curtains, down lights. And a giant mirror, hello. I, I wouldn't imagine that's a standard, I imagine. No. Well, it just shows what you can do. You could I also put a cabinet as well yeah. for extra storage. You could also build some storage around here too. There is space for laundry basket. And then, ooh, wow. Oh, it's like the teddy bear's ah. picnic. Oh, that's cute. That is very, very cute. Look at the mural. Oh, wow. Wow. I want to be in that scene. <laughs> we'll get one done in the spare bedroom. I want to be under that tree. <laughs> we'll get the one done in our own house. Yeah, so this they've done it as a twin bedroom, but you could easily get a double bed, king-size yeah. bed, I would imagine, in here in as here. well. So it is a good-size bedroom. Yeah. There's even space for more built-in wardrobes. Yeah, so you've got the bulkhead of the stairs, so if you didn't have the wardrobes, you would see that. So I, I would advise putting the wardrobes in, um, in either yourself room. or with the developer on this room and the one opposite, because they obviously they share the stairs bulkhead. But with the wardrobes, there are plenty of space for clothes. Okay, I really like this room. It's cute. It's cute. It's gorgeous. Yeah. Okay, we need to choose our favourite room. Where will it be? Ooh, type in the comments below where your yeah. favourite room is. Okay, so we chose the kitchen. It is it's, gorgeous. It's a really amazing room. And I imagine even without the upgrades, you've still got the same space, you've still got yeah. the same layout. And of course, you could upgrade later if you wanted to. Um, I think this house is really, really good. As, but it's very flexible accommodation. With having the extra reception room as well, it really could be whatever yeah. you wanted and to be. And that fourth bedroom, you can have whatever as you wanted. Yeah. Okay. Walking it's, wardrobe. It's a very room. flexible family accommodation. Yes. Um, so I would definitely say check out the links in our description box below. All the contact details are there. We'll also pop the floor plans as well, if we haven't already, at the end of this video. So thank you for watching this video. If you've enjoyed it, please give it a big old thumbs up. Don't forget to share on social media. And of course, do hit the bell so that you know whenever we upload a new video. So from us, to you all, and goodbye. goodbye.